What's up guys? It's your man Kudos and I'm kind of mad at this point because this is actually my third time trying to record this commentary because the first time something went wrong with saving and the other time I accidentally deleted the commentary. So let's just get into this. This commentary will be about on this time that I like messed up a bunch of times. I do not want to really spoil it for you. And so yeah, here we go. So this happened about like one or maybe two summers ago i think it was two most likely it was probably two but still i think it was probably last summer and so this day me and two of my friends i will just say their name is gary and tommy because i do not want to really share their personal name because they did not give me permission to and so um <clears throat> one day we were like, all right, so this happened a couple of times. Well, we never got caught for this, but like, no, it has nothing to do with drugs or alcohol. We don't do that. And so, um, one day we were like, well, this happened a couple of days. We would do this. We would, uh, go and just pitch rocks at this house, at this abandoned house. Nobody used it. Um, it was not under reconstruction so they had windows at this house and we would just like pick up rocks and throw it at the uh, windows and we would just try to break them it wasn't really a competition to see who could break the most windows we just like to break them and so we were just throwing it at the house and so like it would just be fun to do because we're actually bored this like neighborhood is really a ghost town we do not have much uh, they did not have much kids around because of hurricane because of the hurricane and so a lot of people moved out of this neighborhood and then so um one day we were just bored we're like let's go play some basketball we're like and i was just like sure and we we're all just all like sure that's what tommy said let's go play some basketball and so we all agreed we went to go play basketball and then we're uh bored again and then um we're like, I don't know, what could we do? And so, Tommy came up with this idea. Well, not, he didn't really come up with this idea, but like, he's just like, let's go throw the racks at the house. And uh, Gary said, sure. And I, and I like, thought to myself, mm, this feels kind of different. I don't really know if I want to. And so, I'm just like, eh, I'm gonna just ignore it. And then I said, sure, let's go. And then we walk like a couple blocks down, a couple of, like streets down. And then so uh, Tommy picked up the first rock. He threw it. Gary picked up the second one. He threw it. They both missed. Uh, Gary hit the window, but it did not break. And then it was my turn. I threw the rock. I missed the window. This happened for a couple of times. We just kept throwing it and missing and hitting it, but it wouldn't break. And then so Tommy... He uh, picked up a rock. He threw it at the window, but it did not break. Gary, he threw it at the house. He missed the window. It was my turn. So I picked up a rock. I was like, mm, I'm going to really throw this rock hard at the uh, window. So then I picked it up. I was like really looking at the window. I got my little uh, pitching uh Pitching stance. Sorry for that. Because I'm really not a good pitcher. So I was just like messing around. So I. As I was in a motion of throwing it. Um, my friend Tommy. He said no kudos. Don't throw it. Because I did not know why. So then as he just said that. The rock left my hand. And it was going forward to the window. I'm like oh it's going to hit the window. And then. So it, it hit the window and the window broke. I was like, oh, and he said, no, oh, run, kudos, run. And I'm like, what, why? I looked at them and then I see this like truck. It was stopped at um, like one street over at the corner. And um, he said, hey, stop throwing rocks at that window. I was like, oh no, we gotta go. And then 
they were like already ahead of me so i ran i'm like oh no the basketball i i made this really dumb decision i went back for the basketball it was probably like two yards away i picked it up and i took off running and then i was kind of behind them in which i know i was uh i was a little bit faster than tommy um and me and gary was the same speed and for some reason i couldn't catch up to either one of them so i'm like why i looked at my feet nothing was on and i'm like i don't know why i just can't catch up i guess it was because of the shoes i had on like some wide shoes and so my brother he named me like he didn't name me but like he came up with this nickname he called me big boots and i'm like well but but that's something else but anyway i was trying to catch up with him and so i said hey let's cut through here they had this field right and so they didn't hear me because i guess they were further up and i'm like oh well i'm gonna just go through it myself so i can catch up with them and then so the man could be further behind me um and then uh like he started chasing after us and so i cut through the field and then man at the time i did not know how to swim so then about like on my seventh step into the field i just like went down like my uh body it just like sank down it just like a quick fall and then i didn't even feel my feet touch the bottom of the mud like i was in mud it was it stank really bad and then so i floated to the top i hurried up and i picked myself up and then i finally caught up with them um and then so they like kudos what happened to you i'm like i don't know but there's no time to talk we gotta run and then so like we were stopped there for a couple seconds i look back the man was closer than to us than ever before i'm like oh no 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 and then he got even more closer to us he gained up on us he was probably like mm, five feet away from us maybe four and a half and i'm like oh no this dude is real close like yeah if he was on a uh on a hood of his truck all he had to do was jump at us then he could catch us he was that close and um but no one like but from the looks of him he wouldn't do it he was very old and um looked about in his 40s 50s probably he used to smoke cigarettes and um anyway so as we were running we took a left and then a right and then he um for some reason he didn't follow us i guess he was just trying to cut us off at one point and then so um we took another left and then so we just went to my house and i'm just like um I'm gonna go inside and I'm gonna take a shower because I stink very bad and then so before like we went there I skipped out on this part I was like uh oh, no bruh Gary I gotta throw up and then he just started dying laughing and then it slowed him down even more I'm like bro it's not the time left we gotta go and I guess I had that feeling because like from the smell and then what was weighing me down and then my adrenaline was running and then um the man was like right behind so I was, i'm not gonna lie i was pretty nervous and then so i'm like oh no 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 i got i got this feeling i really hope i don't do this and then so yeah we made it to my house i'm like i'm gonna go take a shower and they're like okay you could go take a shower we're just gonna hide behind your house because we do not want to be seen i don't know why did why did why did they not just come into my house but luckily they didn't and um because i'll tell you why so they didn't come into my house and then i took a shower like as i walked into my house i looked and i saw my dad he was sitting in the living room watching the tv and then he's like boy what happened to you i said like the first thing that could come up in my mind i said dad i fell down while we we're playing tag he said oh all right we'll go take a shower and i'm like okay so i'm like "Ooh, the coast is clear i am free and then so i took my shower about 10 to 15 minutes later i took like three showers and washed my hair twice i was really scrubbing and then so the smell still wasn't gone then i heard a knock on the door doom 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 i'm like oh no like the it was about like this loud and then i'm like oh no like it was they were pounding I'm like, no, 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 no. It can't be the cops. I please hope it don't be the cops. 
And good thing it wasn't the cops. It was just the man. He knocked on the door. He told my dad everything he saw. He saw. He said that he saw that I threw the rock. And then I'm like, oh, I know. But then my dad came at me. He just had like a little speech. And I guess he wasn't really that mad. I guess because like he was young ones and he used to like to get into stuff. So then, yeah. And then. It was funny because he wasn't really mad and I thought I was about to get like murdered from him and then so he like actually just treated me to Popeyes and I love Popeyes and well that's the end. So I hope you enjoyed it and peace out and be cool.